Welcome back, Math Grizz. Today, we will be subtracting across zeros. 300 take away 157. Let's show that with the picture. At the top, we need 300. On the bottom, we need 157. 100, 5 tens, and 7 ones. Now, we don't have any ones or tens on top, so we have to go to the hundreds place. We're gonna take one of those hundreds and we're gonna break it into 10 tens. Now that we have 10 tens, we're gonna take one of those tens and we're gonna break it into 10 ones. Let's begin subtracting by crossing off. One, one, two, two, three, three, four, four, five, five, six, six, seven, seven. We have one, two, three left. Let's subtract the tens by crossing off. We have one, one, two, two, three, three, four, four, five, and five. We have one, two, three, four left. Let's subtract the hundreds. We have one, one. We are left with just 100. Let's subtract 300 take away 157 the standard way. Since we don't have any ones, we have to borrow from the tens, but we don't have any tens either, so we have to go all the way to the hundreds place. So now we're gonna borrow one of those hundreds, and we're gonna be left with two hundreds. We can give those hundreds that we borrowed over to the tens place, which would make 10 tens. But we still don't have ones. Now we can borrow from the tens, so we're gonna take one of those tens, and we're gonna be left with nine tens. And now we can give those over to our ones place, so let's go ahead and add 10 that we just took away from the tens place. 10 take away 7 is 3, 9 take away 5 is 4, and 2 take away 1 is 1. Now we're going to use the box trick. We need to put a box over 30, and we're going to take away 1, which makes 29. Now we're going to add 10 more to our 1s. 10 take away 7 makes 3, 9 take away 5 is 4, and 2 take away 1 is 1. All the differences for these three strategies are 143.